Take off your secret agent hat just for tonight and put on your adventure hat. It's finally ready! Too bad you can do nothing but watch as I prepare to launch my space laser predator! My very own nemesis! Oh, Heinz, how can he be your nemesis? He doesn't even have a hat. No, no, I made that mistake a couple of times too, but that's him, I swear! In your letters, you said your nemesis was a suave, semi-aquatic personification of unstoppable, dynamic fury. He is! No, you've just got to see him in action. Here, here I'll let him go. <laughs> go ahead, Perry the Platypus. Thwart my plans. Come on, let me have it. Thwart away, big guy. Heinz. Get thwart. He's just a platypus. They don't do much, you know. No, no, wait, 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 wait. He's just about to do something. Wait for it. The platypus, she can't see you. She doesn't know I have a nemesis. Oh, and, and I don't have time to destroy you. You can be my pet. You think you can act like a mindless animal? Oh, uh, hello. I'm looking for Strudel Cutie 4427. Well, are you the cutest little thing? Are you my day for this evening? No, no, I, uh, that would be me. I'm Strudel. I hold him a little longer? He's so sweet. Oh, yes, yes, he's <laughs> Well, yes, I guess he can I stay a, a little bit, but you know what they say. Three's a crowd and whatnot. <laughs> you are the cutest thing I have ever seen. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You know, some people say we look alike. Yeah, I don't think so. Not at all. No, not at all. Uh, darling, you haven't even touched your cucumber water. I made it especially for you. You know, Strudel Cutie 4427 was a lot less needy online. Oh, yes, yes. I'm Wait, going to go yes, get some was air. A lot less needy online. Well, that's precisely what happened to our first guest, Perry the Platypus. Perry the Platypus, share with us your thoughts. Uh, I I'm sorry, he, do he doesn't actually talk. <gasps> ah, I see. And this communication issue is what led you to replace Perry the Platypus. No, I of course not. To Peter... Peter the panda doesn't talk either. He's a, he's a panda bear. I see. Because he's an animal, he doesn't talk. Of course not. What kind of an evil scientist are you? Right. Doctor, what if I were to tell you Peter the panda is backstage right now? What? Uh, Peter the panda is here? Ooh. Peter the platypus. I, I had no idea. I... Ladies and gentlemen, Peter the panda. Oh! <laughs> Dr. Doofenshmirtz, tell Perry the Platypus how you feel. Perry the Platypus, I, I'm so sorry I hurt you when I wasn't actually trying to hurt you. If you give me another chance, I promise to hurt you in the right way with cartoonish physical violence and elaborate traps constructed out of strange things I've purchased over the internet. What do you say? Oh, that is sweet. Well, what do you say, Perry the Platypus?